Hey, Collective, what's up? What's up? What's up, my buttercups? What's up, buttercups? I want to do a tarot message for us today. I'm going to get out a oracle card first, though, so don't go nowhere, okay? Film for towels. Need to wake up. <laughs> Hang on a minute. So here we go, Collective. Let's see what it wants to talk about what. Oh, wow. Star seeds. Oh, wow. You're brought here to raise the universe's vibrations because unity is what will align us all for our life's purposes. Okay, star okay. seeds. So this is about star seeds. What else about star seeds? You're a goddess. Oh, you're a goddess starseed. The feminine expressed through wisdom, nature, life force, and sensuality. So, you know, you're you're the goddess. You're empress. You're divine feminine. You're starseed. You're brought here to show others old ways and teachings. Yep, that's what you're brought here to speak about, starseed. You're... You got the ability to communicate knowledge, experience, skill, and wisdom. That's what you're doing, and you, you help wake up people because you got to go inside and clear out all negative energy from past hurts. Whoever's past hurts, you now collect them. Uh, that's what you got to do. Let me get one or two of these. Spirit, spirit. Run wild for a while. That's what star seeds do. Sometimes you might go wild and for a little while. Star child, I love my spirit team. See how they see how this is all connected. And I welcome you if you're new to my channel and I hope that you would hit that subscribe button, you all, and I'll try to give you a, a, some tarot guidance. This is uh this is your sacred journey. You're on your pilgrimage. Looky there. I like these cards. Not many people has these. This is your journey. You're on your journey to become a star. Uh, maybe it felt like I'm running with the pack. I'm running with the pack. I'm never looking back. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Bad company. Maybe, star seeds, you learned that you didn't want to be around this bad company anymore where all this negative shit was around and you started discovering other realms. You know, this is about, looks like this man has the tree of knowledge. This is about you, you navigating through different realms of your conscious mind. subconscious you can also go maybe you can even go into the spirit realm like if you are um you know like a psychic a medium you know what i mean i think i'm gonna use these hang on running with the bag, never looking back whoa, 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 whoa. I used to like Bad Company. Did you guys? I did too. You know, let's see what Star Seeds needs to know. Star Seeds. Oh, we got the devil. And it coming the upside down. But this is the devil in the light energy. Okay. <laughs> it says, aware I might trip and then lose the way. I make sure my devil can't lead me astray. So... So, in that way, that's what it means, but upside down. So, you've been led astray. Somebody's been led astray, starseed. And look, listen on starseeds in the dark energy because they give you these cards to ride on, and I'm like the only one ever seen ride on them. So, so the shadow side of being a starseed, this is what I understood. You can be led down the wrong path if you aren't careful, but your ancestors is always there for you. Even if you go down that wrong path, they still give you signs and 
they try to make you pay attention. And that's what they're doing right now, I'm telling you. You're meant to be a star goddess teacher because you're a star seed. Okay? So let's leave that out right there. Maybe that's why you you had that wild harnessed energy inside and you had to let it out. Maybe you've been in a connection for a long time. Yeah, look. This is the magician in the light side and it says... Belief and focus can make things happen. Knowing this truth is my magical weapon. So you got to trust. Trust and belief is my magical weapon. I, how, how long have I trusted this? You know, this is about, you know, your alchemizing. This is about your faith and your inner knowing. You're staying focused. You're, you're in a manifestation period at the moment. This is using white magic. You have the ability to make things happen as above, so below. As above, so below, star, star child. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening for someone out here. It's happening for someone. And here we got the hermit in the dark side. It says, I withdraw from the world. I have good reason, but not for too long, just for a season. So... So you know that you have to withdraw and go inside and heal on the inside. I mean, all, all the star seeds understand that. This is about uh, you, you've been overthinking something way too much. And you might have been refusing to, to listen to the wisdom of yourself and guidance of others. You know? So, um... Maybe you've, you've been denying your shadow side. Addiction to one or more of the seven deadly sins. Pride, greed, lust, envy, wrath, gluttony, and sloth. So so you're, you're tied to somebody like that in your wolf pack. Get it? You're tied to somebody in your pack that is still in this energy star child. And it could be somebody under me. And, and I'm telling you... You've got a sacred journey. You better clean up that self. See, you got to have the strength to tame that line within yourself, within yourself. Because, you know, I can tell you all one thing. This goddess, you know, we all feel that sensual, sexual, oh, look at me when we're young. You know what I'm saying? And when we get older, it tends to not matter as much things. You know what I mean? Like, we're good with herself regardless. You know what I mean? Uh, this is about self-love. You got emotional strength and mental courage. This is inner, tran inner tranquility, compassionate, tolerant. See, on your journey, you're, you're meant to not stay inside hiding away from everyone. Okay? Because you're a spiritual master or a counselor. So stop hiding it because you're alchemizing. You got to have a lot of strength on this spiritual path, teacher. Okay? You're because you can explore other realms, but then here we got the hanged man in the dark energy. It says, Hanged and feeling powerless is not my usual style. I'll trust that in the long run it proves to be worthwhile. So this is about you've been feeling powerlessness to something and frustrated. Use the sacrificial lamb. Feeling lonely and uncomfortable. See, you've got a lot of down strength inside. Why do you keep feeling this? Short-term pain. Long-term gain. But you as the sacrificial lamb. That's why spirit guides give you the right to be this teacher goddess star seed to help these other star children realize you know you can't keep on feeling powerless in this situation star you gotta you're alchemizing coming out of darkness you're alchemizing coming from from being in isolation you're alchemizing it so you're gonna have to have the strength and the damn courage to do it and you might have to cut off somebody okay Oh, because look on the bottom is temperance and the lovers and the star and judgment. Look, look on the bottom, all light energy. Look, 
This is your energy, star seeds. Look, you're balanced in your masculine and feminine qualities and, and sides. This is about, you know, um, doing things in moderation. You feel harmonious. And, and you know how to compromise. You, you don't do things in the excess anymore. See, I've learned that. I don't, I don't, I don't care what anybody says. I know I don't. This is about you and your soulmate, your lover. This could be your twin flame, okay? This is Gemini energy. This is is uh, to love and be loved is how it should be. I rejoice in the love that comes to me. <laughs> oh, uh, you're attracted uh, to this soulmate. You feel whole. You feel whole with this soulmate. You feel balanced and whole. Star? How many star seeds do we need? I love spirit guides, okay? It says, the starlight shining down on me brings healing from above. I am at peace with my life and filled with hope and love. Yeah, you're a star. I'm a star, Aquarius. And see, I'm glad this energy pulled out like this. Uh, you know, uh, you, 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 this is, um, you wished upon, you dared to wish upon a star. The calm after the storm, renewal of the life force within your shining light of understanding to others this is about you're an inspiration to others to reach stardom and i'm glad i can do that you all and that's you know i keep thinking that i'm going to be a star and i know i will be because judgment you're rising above the material surface i take up the sword and find my true purpose this is your true purpose this is my true purpose. And would y'all please get this around? Help me in the spiritual community because they latched onto my internet. If you're new, please hit subscribe to help me grow because I do have a lot of good information to tell us star seeds. And I make all my own beautiful cards, okay? It says, you are an earth angel, a star seed. You have a greater purpose, honey. See? Star seeds, star seeds, love. How much more do I have to tell you all shit? You, you have a purpose. My purpose is to teach. I don't know this, okay? So I'm trying to make you all realize. And remember, all things that we go through is only to make us a stronger and wiser, beautiful soul. Oh, look how beautiful collective. You got them star seed goddess eyes. People's like, oh, God almighty, you're the strongest, wisest soul we've ever seen. Somebody's trying to figure out what all our superhuman powers are. Well, this teacher's going to show you that she's a damn star seed. And if you pay attention, that she's showing you right now. She's showing you right now. Did you see? I love this spirit, guys. I appreciate you. Oh, and you have to appreciate everything in life that God bestowed upon you. Did you hear me? I said I appreciate you. I appreciate my superhuman powers. I love you, God. I love you, God, for giving me my powers and my twin, and I appreciate you. And remember, rumors doesn't equal truth. It only makes it harder on you to get out, out, out of all the lies and the slander. There's three sides to the story, yours, theirs, and the truth. And remember that. And remember that. Remember that. See, so somebody around has noticed that this was a bunch of rumors. They love you. They're stronger and wiser soul with you now. Oh, and it may be your boss. Your boss may want to build a life with you. He's got intense love for you. He wants to marry you. This is somebody that you worked for, maybe. Maybe people went around lying on you and this boss. Maybe y'all had intense feelings for each other, but you never did get to explore your feelings for each other, and they went around speaking and bullshitting on your name, and that's what it was. But didn't you know what? You got to wake up at the crack of dawn in order to get the life that you adore. You got to put one foot in front of the other and you got to get on that damn road and get to it. Mm -hmm. You're, you are going to be a success. You're bossing up totally. And this is my poem. Do not steal it. It says, you, you're a, your spirit is like a wildflower growing next to the interstate. You see its beauty and it always catches everyone's eyes. It's wild and free. It catches everyone's eyes. Ooh. Oh, wow. Goddess, you catch everyone's eyes. They see how beautiful you are. That's what it is. It's boss said, your eyes is beautiful. 
Oh, God. And it said, a good person will let you have something that you're in need of and not ask for anything in return. So, somebody... So, this boss knows you're a good person and you never ask for anything. <laughs> These people lied on you and they love you. And the angels come to heal you and to administer to you in your time of need. See, that's why. You need to get this reading around. It'll help a lot of star seeds. If anybody cares, that's what you'll do. If you care and want to help me, you better. But you better, somebody out here better take acknowledgement for their own actions and th things they've said and done. See, the, the angels is trying to heal you. Because <coughs> you didn't ask anything about this. This person didn't. Um, you're wild and free. You're a good person. The, the angels is here for you right now in your time of need. Because somebody went and blabbed on you and this boss. About you all marrying each other. Somebody went and blabbed it. Somebody saying, hey, how'd you know your super... What is your superhuman powers? I, I've got a lot of powers. <laughs> 1616, I just saw. And uh, these people that went around lying, if they don't take acknowledgement, they're going to go down. That's what it means. I mean, that's on them, so don't worry about it. The karmic is trying to fraud you, Divine Masculine. Or you, Divine Feminine, or the both of you. Somebody's saying... Somebody's got to uh, take acknowledgement for them trying to, for them fraud in your name. They got to take acknowledgement for it. Yeah, good. 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 You're all very magnetic, and this person is nervous when they come into contact with you. Shaky magnets, law of attraction. So this karmic's trying to fraud you and divine masculine. This person, um,. Might be nervous around you at the moment. Somebody, this karmic is is shaky at the moment. They're shaky because they know that when you come together with this person, give them the opportunity to talk and say what they need to say and keep quiet. So this karmic is going to try to come and talk to you and you need to be quiet and listen to what they're saying. This person that's shaky and they're they're doing the law of attraction for I don't know if that's the karmic trying to fuck with you. I think that's this boss. This karmic must have did something to their kids. They they frauded the karmic tried to fraud you, divine masculine and divine feminine. Maybe um This is an authority figure that's trying to fraud you all. Yeah, they're trying to cock block you all from coming together. But they don't understand the law of attraction. Oh, and this person, whoever this um, person is, this boss that wants to marry you, his old lady is screwing around behind his back. That boss's old lady's doing that. They're cock blocking you. But Archangel Michael is your protector, and he watches over me and you, Collective. So, hey. Hey. They blocked you from this person you felt magnetically drawn to. They're shaky because they went around screwing. They're shaky because they went around screwing. This karmic that must have messed with Divine Mask one because she's a damn bitch and she beats her kids. Yeah, I don't know. That ain't me. So I've did it a couple of times for good reason. But they some people that did you wrong and they're telling a bunch of a new version to somebody. And maybe Archangel Michael and the law is protecting you. Archangel Raphael is too. And he, he he's might have healed you from uh sickness. But this is about bringing your mind, spirit, and body all in line and stop being in the victim mode or something and say no to a narcissist, okay? Divine feminine goddesses out here, they some narcissist listening in on your phone calls and bugged your home. Oh, listen, listen. This narcissist is listening on your phone calls, and a narcissist will say, I hate that fucking word, and I hate when you say it. And that's how you know they're a narcissist. Did you know that part? 
Uh, they've been caught blocking you. Uh, they've been screwing around with this woman behind your back. They've been blocking you to, from this divine masculine that was nervous as hell every time he got around you because he fucking loved you. He loved you. He loved you because he's your fucking twin flame. And he wants to have a sexual union with you. He is your secret admirer. You all have a powerful connection. Oh, God. Give thanks for these blessings getting ready to come into your life. Give thanks. Oh, God, because they can't wait to get a giant teddy bear hug from you and say, fuck this person that cock blocked you. Fuck them. And remember that tests and challenges will always come. And know that the devil will try to tempt you away from your purpose. Know that they'll always do that and they're not going to be able to. But the devil didn't want you to be with your spiritual love because... He and she, both of you all, is very gifted from God, Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine. They was trying to steal mine and your spiritual gifts. They're trying to steal them. And I know they fucked with my phone, and I told you I need help with a subscription. If you could please do that, I need your help. If you could please like and leave me a comment. Every day somebody watches it this far. Thank you. Because these people, the heat is in the kitchen on their eyes now. So let's see if they can take it. Let's see if the narcissist can take all this heat that's getting ready to be on them. <laughs> that's what's sad. Oh, power hungry people get nothing good in life. Somebody's power hungry. They're fucking stupid. They're dumb. They're dumb. And remember, the narcissist will create a smear campaign to try to add votes to their team. They'll lie to anybody that listens to them. Yep, we know that. They're power hungry too. They're power hungry, and they might have sent a psychopath towards you. So pay attention, my collective. Hang on, let me do a read. Let's see what this says for us, collective. Hang on, let me pull out right like this, and then I'll tell you what it says. Do what the dee dee the dee dee. Oh, ain't that funny that come out right there? It just said it. I love you, spirit guides. Oh, wow. Oh, that what it is. That what it is. Lick, lick, lickety, clickety. Lick, lick, lickety, dickety. Sorry, you guys. I had to say it. It was just funny, I guess. Oh, do the patee, La, la, da, 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 la, baby. Funny on the bottom, 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 hit my bottom, funny on the bottom, funny on the bottom. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, here we go, collective. Here, here, here we go. Okay, so it said, can't stop looking at you. They, they admire, respect, and love you. They desire you. They stand in attention for you. Oh, God, they want to touch your titties or something. Oh, wow. And... It said, they want you to be their best hamster mom ever. Pay attention. Use your smart mind, hamster moms. <laughs> they admire you. They want to feel you. Touch the, they want you to touch them. 2433. She believed she could, so she did touch him. It said, hey, hey, hey. Remember, and it said, the devil didn't want you to be with your spiritual love because he or she's very gifted. But she believes she could, so she did be with her spiritual love. He, he's going to drill you till it squirts, baby. Oh, guys. 
Someone that he knows how to make uh, you squirt. Oh, God. He also knows there is another in the fire standing next to you, and it's Satan. Satan is awaiting. Here's a test. Test is Satan is awaiting at the bus stop for you. Satan is awaiting, and it said, uh, this is direction the west. So this could be out California, stuff like that. Somebody is tr going to dare you. Satan is getting ready to dare you. To dare you maybe to come to the Virgin Islands, okay? And uh, they're wanting you to hide away from reality for a little while. That's what it's meaning with them. And it says, Sofa is so good. I swear he's an angel. Let's get weird and octopus. He wants to get octopus on the daggum sofa. He wants to get octopus. that say me i swear to me he's an angel it says i swear to me he's an angel oh well then it says the devil is on drugs keeping you tied to old habits you can keep your drugs and all your habits i'm done with your damn issues i and go have a lovely day that's what you told him that's what shark told him and it's some bitch up here they're just addicted to their dope Oh, addicted to dope and making you drill it and squirt it. It's a test. This devil is trying to keep you stuck at the fucking house with them. Yeah. That's a test for Satan. Okay. What else did it say? Smoke and coke, anyone? Smoke and coke, anyone? Uh, that's what somebody said. And somebody said, Homeland Security. Homeland Security. Fighting terrorism since 1492. You know, because that's when C Christopher Columbus sailed the, sailed the ocean blue, remember? Christopher Columbus went down around Virgin Islands. Didn't they go travel there too? So, yeah. Oh, and it's just saying, uh, oh, the, somebody needs to call security. Uh, maybe you, uh, you've been fighting this son of a bitch for a long time and you're getting ready to be in a divorce. You're going to split up. You're wearing your crown and you're taking care of yourself. This is what's going to happen. Okay. You need to stop hiding reality and doing this shit. Okay. And then it said, everything happens for a reason. And then here we have North. So Northwest, maybe you're going to move to Northwest. Or, you know, that's that's Kim Kardashian and uh, Kanye's daughter, uh, Northwest, remember? And uh, this is Taurus Virgo Capricorn energy, and Saturn and Jupiter is the planet. Magical power to be silent. To be silent. So, this spiritual partner love of yours, you know that they're meant for you, and they do too, and they want you to come... Stay with them. They want to get weird with you. And uh, they, they've been being silent. They've been being silent, but it says just keep going. Don't let others even have a peek in your life or in your energy underneath that. And beside this right here, it says, that why, you intelligent man. That's why, you intelligent man, Aquarius. That's why. That's why you need to tell these people. Like me, like Aquarius did. I said, hey, you can keep your drugs and all your habits. I'm done with your issues and shit, man. It's getting on my fucking nerves. And you've been working hard and being nice. And maybe you used to work on a railroad or the oil rigs. Somebody wants to to uh, oil your can. They want to oil your can. They respect you. They're like, get away from that devil. Get away from the devil. They're only wanting drugs. Keep you in drug life. And then it says, my new family. So maybe you're going to work hard and nice and be with your new family. You're going to get away from this damn other person. Because you got a lot of, you're dreaming big, 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 baby. Keep that dream big and just keep going. Just keep going. Tooting along, tooting along. 24 hours growth. 24 hours growth. That why? That why, you intelligent Aquarius? 
You might be just going to go in 24 hours or so. <laughs> you might just going to be go in 24 hours or so. That's what it said now, Collective. That is what in the hell it said. Let me see what this says. You're ascending. You're evolving. This is universal intelligence. Stay connected to spirit. Stay, stay connected to spirit. Because um, maybe you're exhausted and having a lot of emotions at the moment. Hang on a minute. What is it that Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine needs to know? You need to know that Tempest, it says your immediate vicinity is wracked by a terrible storm. If you're inside, the structure could be destroyed entirely. So someone is trying to send a storm into your life. Well, you know, tower, you need to get away from that person that's wanting to keep you in, in drugs. Sometimes you gotta let them towers fall collective. I know it's hard. I know I've, I've had so many tower moments, but we just got to do it. And we got radiator butterfly here. And you send out a beacon of love, comfort, and upliftment through your bond with spirit. That's what I try to do, collective. Stay connected to spirit, okay? I try to uplift you guys. And then we got Siren. You capture the attention of a sorceress maiden. She immediately begins planning to lure you to her lair and make you her thrall. So, so someone is... a. Uh, Feeling like they're want, they're in love with you, and that's the one wanting to drill it to its squirts. Maybe <laughs> it says your party is transported to the entrance of a labyrinth. The only escape is to find the center. A guardian minotaur lurks somewhere within, somewhere within this labyrinth that you went in. You have to reach the center. That's the escape. You have to reach the center, but there's somebody. It always feels like somebody's lurking around you. Yeah, because they know you're a prophet and you see the future and tell others what is coming and how to prepare for it. Well, I just told you, somebody, there's get ready to be a bad storm. A terrible down storm is coming and it's going to tire the hell out of a bunch of stuff. And it could be in the Virgin Islands. Oh, and it says draw two additional cards, gesture. So maybe this person is like a funny little court gesture. Fool. It said you feel foolish because you're remaining at your current level. Yeah, because this siren has... Attach something uh, like a maze for you to get out of or some shit. Oh, and they're like a little hostile dragon. They're trying to burn your shit to the damn ground. And Merc and Wolves, they got 16 or more people following you in the background. Prophet. Prophet, you got 16 people trying to tire up what you're building in the background. That's crazy, ain't it? It is. Hero, you have come... To a stand up for what's right and overcome adversity along your way. I need a hero. I'm coming after the morning. In the morning light. And he's got to be strong. And he's got to be tough. And he's got to be stronger than life. I need a hero. That was on Shrek. <laughs> Shrek. Remember Shrek, the big ogre? It says, you speak to spirits who have passed beyond the veil and bring hope and comfort to the living. I do. Every time I hear something from my uh, spirit guides, I'll let y'all know. I always do. Last card. Talon. They're trying to make all your magical items disintegrate. See, they're trying to burn you down. They're wanting you to feel like you can't escape, like you can't escape this maze that they've made for you. But you're going to be okay because you've prophesied, you've already talked to things like this, and now uh, people's realizing it's true. They, they've listened. They know. 
They know people's trying to burn everything I got down. Because it comes out every day. Hell, it has to be true. You know what? Spirit guides, can we have a message? Ooh, that was fast. Yeah, I love you, spirit guides. Wow, you did it so fun like that. How did you do that? Any more? Ooh, wow. Too many. Two, 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 two. Uh, it's three. Okay. Direct descendant. Your prophet. Look, prophet. Twice it says prophet. Do y'all believe I'm a good tarot reader yet? Well, you should. You're a prophet. Maybe you're an astrologer. You're a psychic. You're definitely a psychic. You're a high priestess. That's what I am. Okay, so, because I've already knew that these storm things was trying to come to my life. This is about, uh, you prophesied something about domestic abuse. Uh, maybe with this sibling of yours, you sh you've shown leadership. This was your lesson. You had to show leadership. Fire, death, fire. Yeah, they're trying to burn, burn your shit down. But you're, you're a watcher or a guardian. Or you was an early earth dweller. You had a close encounter. Or you're... You're from another world, an off-world or extraterrestrial watcher or guardian. So you're a prophet who said, hey, I'm a watcher or guardian from the time of Atlantis to come back here and tell you all about the lesson of this abuse of technology, how these watchers come steal every fucking thing that I do. And their identity is a young male. They're a young male siren. So instead of a girl, it should be a damn boy. Okay? Yep, yep, yep. They haven't, they're struggling with their appearance at the moment. Okay? But maybe you're the town beauty. Like, you're beautiful. And maybe they went around lying and say, use a prostitute film for towel. Yeah, they went around, they went around lying and saying you was a damn up prostitute, but you're a town beauty. You're the town beauty, and that siren hates you and me because we're beautiful. That's all it is. And then we have doctor, healer, faith healer. This is about you are a faith healer. Me, I'm a faith healer. Somebody might be. Um, this is about what you're building at the moment. You're building at the moment your tribe of friends. Look, friends. You're building at the moment your tribe of friends, your companionship who will love you. Um, they know that you're a medium, and they know that you've had to endure a lot of torture like I have. Uh... Maybe you was a tribal hunter... You was some other tribal hunter back way long ago. Like when Earth first started. Did you hear that? That's what it's saying. And then it says, uh, yep. You was the leader, see? You was the leader long ago in this, tri in this other tribe. Where y'all did group living, you all went out and hunted in masses. You know what I mean? And you was the hunt leader. Oh, wow. You're the hunt leader, prophet. Oh, I love that. This is about nature worship, druidism, pantheism, animalism, Francescan mythicism. This is about stop having a guilty conscience. Stop having a guilty conscience with this grandchild. The lesson is this this grandchild has prophecy and you're you're you got prophecy and gifts and your grandchild has prophecy and gifts. So oh. and somebody has deceived or betrayed you in your love. Okay. That's what it said now, collective. Now shoot far. That's what it said, collective. I love y'all, collective. I believe that's that's all I'm gonna get out of here today. I hope it's helped somebody out here, okay? Because you're meant to do big things, prophet. And somebody's going to get shaken to the core here real soon. Because they've sent up, they've been swirling a shit storm around. And now it's going to come back to them. And like I said, it could be in the Virgin Islands. Or California. I think I said that earlier. If it wasn't this reading, it was that other reading that I just did. I don't know. But somebody, 
somebody wants to uh, stand up with you. They want to stand up with you because they know you speak with the spirits. And nature loves you. That's what it says. And I love you, Collective, and I appreciate you so very much. And that might be a knight that's wanting to come forward and speak to you. This is your defender. This is your bodyguard. Special intelligence. Because this is about your self-expression, okay? There's a natural disaster getting ready to happen. I love you all, and I hope this helps somebody today. Please like, subscribe, and share my videos. Peace.